Hello and welcome. You're watching Beyond World is One. My name is Mohammed Saleh, and let's start this broadcast by taking a quick look at what is making headlines at this hour. The Nobel laureate Mohammed Yunus takes charge as the of the caretaker government in Bangladesh. He's been sworn in as the head of the interim government. Three days after Sheikh Hasina was forced to quit and flee from the country. The Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi has offered his very best wishes to Bangladesh's newly sworn in interim leader Muhammad Yunus and has urged him to ensure the safety of Hindus and all other minority communities within Bangladesh. Volodymyr Zelensky says that Russia brought war to his country and now must feel the consequences after Ukraine has launched an unprecedented incursion across the border into the Kursk region. America's most advanced fighter jets, the F-22 Raptor stealth warplanes, arrive in West Asia. This, according to the American military, as Washington is boosting its military presence in the region, ahead of an expected Iranian counterattack on the state of Israel after the Israelis assassinated Ismail Haniyeh in Iran. The United Nations Security Council convenes for a briefing on the threat posed by the ISIS as the terror group continues to expand in West Africa and the Sahel region. And Nagasaki's mayor has said that it is really unfortunate that the United States of America and also the British ambassadors have now refused to attend a ceremony marking the 1945 American atomic bombing of the Japanese city because the state of Israel was snubbed. This is what I dreamed about, walking with pride and my team gave that to me, that's enough. And the world of Indian hockey, PR Srijesh speaks to Vion after winning a second straight Olympic bronze medal. Srijesh ends his international career on a high. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.